So moving on to our next topic on mobile automation with APM, we are going to talk about a method which is to set and get location of your particular app or device. Now this location is the geo location and it could be useful uh, specifically when you are testing apps which uh, have got some feature which is related to a particular location. Maybe something like your Google Maps, right? So where uh, you need to set or you need to get the particular geo location of the device uh, before you execute any particular functionality. So this could be useful in these type of scenarios. So uh, let's go ahead and let's create uh, a new test. Uh, again, we'll continue to work on the Android, but you can always do this on iOS as well. So uh, let's go ahead and create a new class here. And uh, we are going to call this uh, geolocation. Okay, and then uh, let's take the construct of our first test. Uh, it's a pretty common one, and that's why I always choose this. So let's go back here, and then uh, we just need to play around with our test method. So first, uh, let's try to get uh, the geolocation of um, our particular device uh, which we are connected to. Okay, so for this, uh, we'll be using one of uh, the classes uh, and methods which are present in the Java APM uh, library. Okay, so uh, we will say here uh, driver dot, and then you will get a method uh, which is get location. And this is going to return a particular value which is of the location type. So for this, we need to create an object of the location class here. So we will assign this particular value to this location object, okay? And from this, uh, we can derive the latitude, longitude, and altitude. So these are the three different values which uh, you can get for a particular location. So let's go ahead and print all these values here, okay? So we'll say location and then Inside this, you will find uh, three different methods uh, for get latitude, get longitude, and get altitude, okay? So what we will do is uh, let's go ahead and print all of these in a single line. Okay, and then I would also insert some text here. So we'll say current geolocation. So this will print the current geolocation of your device. And now uh, what we can do is we can go ahead and set the location for uh, our device as well, right? So what we'll do is we can use driver.setLocation. And inside this, again, we need to provide it um, the location type, okay? So what we will do is we will go ahead and provide this new location and inside this will again provide the values, okay? So, so here uh, we will provide the values, okay? Uh, not necessarily any specific values. You can also provide specific values if you want, but uh, let's put something generic here, okay? So this is how you can uh, get your current location and you can also set the location. Now, after this, you can perform all the different verifications or all the different functionalities uh, which you want to check in your particular application once you get or set the location, right? So let's go ahead and run this test now and let's see whether it is able to get the geolocation. Okay, so as you can see here, uh, it is giving me this particular geolocation. Obviously, I can put uh, some text around it or I can even print this uh, in three different lines to make it more um, specific on which is the latitude, which is the longitude and which is the altitude. But uh, this is how uh, it will look like, okay? To format it a little bit, so what I can do is um, I can put some spaces around uh, 
my particular values okay so let's go ahead and do that let's put uh, some space here after uh, we particularly print uh, different values okay so now if i go ahead and run this uh, we should see the values uh, separated with a particular space so these are uh, the values uh, the first one is the latitude the second one is the longitude and uh, the last one is the altitude okay so this is how you can get your current geolocation for your device. And then uh, if you want to uh, set the location before you run any particular um, verification or validation, then uh, you can use the set location method. So that's all uh, for uh, this particular topic uh, where we talked about how to get the geolocation and how to set the geolocation of a particular device using the different classes and methods which are available in the APM client library. That's all for this particular video. If you have any questions, then please leave it in the comments. If you like this video, then please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.